Hi guys, it's Mark from The Backbone Project. Um, I want to talk about Google AdWords quickly. This is a very short video just to uh, demonstrate a super important, the missing element, the magic number that people are missing, the magic formula when it comes to down to Google AdWords. And I want to go into a little bit of techco speak, I'm sorry to say, just to talk about impressions and click-through rate, which you may have heard when you or you may have noticed when you first set up your campaigns. Now let me tell you, if you're setting up your campaign utilizing the Google's own um, sign-up pages, then it's going to set you up to fail. It's a pretty sorry state of affairs. You need to be cleverer than, um, than the way Google sets it up in order so it can make the most money straight away from you, unfortunately. And that's where a lot of people are when they come to me. They've uh, put their credit card in, they've spent a fortune, and they're, the words out of their mouth go along the lines of, I've tried the Google AdWords thing and it doesn't work. Well, straight away, you need to understand what an impression is. An impression is when your advert appears on the screen. So if you've um, targeted a particular word for chocolate moon cookies and your advert pops up, um, if somebody, that's, that's called an impression. If it pops up a thousand times, that's a thousand impressions. If it pops up a hundred times, that's a hundred impressions. So every time your ad shows, it's an impression. Click-through rate. Let's talk about the click-through rate. Your click-through rate is simply how often, what ra a ratio of those impressions to clicks. Now remember, Google only earn money, and you only earn money, if somebody clicks on your ad and then takes action. But Google only make money when somebody clicks on the ad. Now it makes sense for Google to serve ads that get clicked. So it wants, it wants you to write ads that get clicked. And the way you write ads that get clicked is to have super relevant ads. You have to write good ads. You have to serve up your ad for specific, relevant terms. And being and going broad, and what I mean by broad is having your ad serve, having an impression for lots and lots of different keywords is really how to fail very, very quickly in, uh, in Google AdWords. Now, it, on every keyword, you can offer a maximum bid. So if you want to buy a particular keyword, chocolate moon cookies, or whatever it is you're selling, then you can set a maximum bid for that, for that particular keyword. It's not necessarily what you pay. The maximum bid is the maximum you're prepared to pay to make sure that your ad is served on, on, um, on that particular keyword. Now, if you multiply your click-through rate with your maximum bid, you're, you create a magic number. And that's really how Google works out how to put your ad and where to serve your ad, what position to serve your ad in. Because it wants to serve ads that get clicked. And the ones that get clicked are the ones it wants to serve towards the top. So having a high click-through rate is going to really be advantageous. Let me show you what I mean. Advertiser A has a 2.5% click-through rate. His maximum bid is $2. So that means that if you multiply 2.5 by $2, you get $0.05. Cents. Advertiser B has a click-through rate of twice Advertiser A at 5%, and he has the same maximum bid. But his magic number is $0.10, cents, or 0 0.10. It's twice what Advertiser A is his. Now, in order for Advertiser A <clears throat> to match Advertiser B, he would have to bid twice as much. It's simple maths. You see, having a higher click-through rate and having... The same maximum bid means that Advertiser B's ads are going to be served over the top of Advertiser A. And this is how you get your ad up into the top positions. And the better your click-through rate, the harder it is to knock you off that, competition, uh, that competitive slot in those top three positions. It's very, very important to understand this. Now you know the magic number. So what is your magic number? Work out your click-through rate. You know, it's super important. It isn't the whole story. Because it's quite simple to get high click-through rate by bidding on a super relevant um, term. What's more difficult is taking that visitor who arrives at your site and then taking them through and converting them into a customer, a buyer. Of course, I go into that much more inside the Backbone Project. So what's your magic number? I would love your comments. Um, so don't forget to subscribe, um, rate and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the Backbone Project. If you want more information, head on over to uh, the Backbone, Google the Backbone Project, and I'll see you over there. Remember, it's all about relevance. If you allow Google to set up your campaigns, you will be set up to fail.